Hey, today we're in Atherton Tablelands. Dad's looking after the kids because, yeah, Mum's at home a bit sick. And we've been told to come on this scenic route to the Miller Miller Waterfalls. <coughs> but she's a bit uh, misty and rainy, so we can't really see much. Miller, Miller. We'll go check it out anyway. Miller, Miller. I think it's going to be one of them days. First one, we've come to the Miller Miller Waterfalls. We can hear it, can't we? Are we there already? Yeah. Well, that's good. Here we are. Pretty cool. <laughs> oh, look at that. Okay, we're going to go down the track and look at the curtain fig tree. Now we're walking down to the Mill Stream waterfall in Ravenshoe, where we're staying, the highest town in Queensland. It's quite a steep track, isn't it, little fella? Ah. Yeah, it's a little bit steep. There's the river down there. We finish off our day spending time at the park. This is where I've probably spent half our life at the moment on the road. We're seeing all types of parks. This is where we've been camped up in Ravenshoe. It's just behind a roadhouse. It's called the Tall Timbers Caravan Park. It has been handy because I've had a few brake issues, which Dad's helped me through on the phone, so thanks for that. And Gemma's been a little bit sick, and it's also been raining for the past four days. Just a quick stop on the way up to Cooktown. We're stopping here for the night, the Palmer River Roadhouse. Looks like a good one. Okay, we're at the Palmer River Roadhouse on the way to Cooktown and this is their famous st steak sandwich with the works. I yep. don't even know where to start. You only live once, eh? Hey? Well, <laughs> we're going to live a bit less after eating this one. <laughs> bon appetit. Where's this one? How much toast did I I don't even know how to eat this. Hi. Hi. Shane's just yeah, making use of free phone boxes and making a call to home. <laughs> so we just got into Cooktown and we've come up to the Green Hill Lookout. This is the hill that Captain Cook first climbed up. And he was a little bit nervous to see all the shallow water and all the reefs poking out. It's a bit of a bird's eye view of the town. There's the town down there. With uh, Mount Cook in the distance. You probably can't see how steep this is in the GoPro. But this is probably the steepest road we've ever been down. Now just having a walk down the main street and looking at all the really old nice buildings and the massive mango trees. 
they are huge. Every second tree is a mango tree. It'd be great to be here around Christmas time when, there's, when they're ripe. This one's the Endeavour River. This is where Mr. Cook landed in 1770. Don't dip your toes in there. There's some snappers. <laughs> Crocodiles, yep. The weather's very tropical today. It's uh, threatening the rain, humid. It's already raining. Yep, I don't think that's been used in a while. Yeah, this guy's just waiting for the tide to come in. <laughs> it looks like he's been waiting a while. Right, what we have here is a very grand statue in, mem in the memoration of the Captain Cook landing in June 1770. Very cool. And just here we got uh, the old cannon. Uh, they brought it here from Scotland because they believed that the Russians were going to invade, which I don't think happened. They still use it these, these days, very occasionally when they have a Captain Cook party. Today we're doing the uh, Bloomfield track. It's a track that goes through from Cooktown to Cape Tribulation. It's a full drive track following the river. I don't think it's necessarily a full drive track. There's just a few really steep sections that you might have to put in full drive to get up and down.
Uh, this is the Bloomfield Falls. Uh, we've seen a lot of waterfalls in our travels, but I reckon this would be nearly be the best one. Well, it's definitely the most powerful one. Well, this one's called Lakelands. It's a gateway to Cape York. It's something I really want to do one day, but I have to set the car up a bit better with a winch and a snorkel. I see a lot of people coming back with red dust. Looks like a lot of fun. So this little park here follows the path of uh, the way to Cape York, just all the little towns and sites you see along the way. So as you go north you um, come across all the roadhouses on the way. It's pretty cool this park, it's well thought out. This is the end of the road. This is as close as we'll get to the tip of Cape York, the fake one. This time, we'll be back. <laughs> We've got one passenger that doesn't want to get on the boat. I don't blame her. The captain's a bit bossy. And we got one catching the fish. What's next, Captain? Sharks for dinner! Shark for dinner! Now we were talking to some people at the last roadhouse we've been to and they mentioned this free camp just up the road here. It's a bit of a ripper. Have a look at this, would ya? Got ourselves a nice little flowing river. Now this is Living Barry. Free camp and you can even have a wash later on. Alright, this is the view of the Great Dividing Range. We're going, going to go down now. I suppose that's the view over the Port Douglas and the Dane Tree. We're going to go down this big hill. Shane's that desperate to Hookabara. We've come to a place called Hookabara. There's 1600 barra in here. If he can't catch one, he'll oh, never no, catch the one. The really on now. <laughs> <laughs> so apparently in the winter, the barra aren't that hungry. So the odds are stacked against him. <laughs> oh, it's 1600, isn't it? <laughs> Dad's finally caught a barra. Woohoo! Got another one. You want to reel, we want to reel it in? No. Sure. Oh. Oh. oh! Here it comes, Joel. Hi. I caught this one at the Cachavara farm. It's two and a half kilos, I caught two of these and I dropped a really big one, but it was okay. Our session, it was a lot of fun. Now I've got to fill it with my blunt knife. <laughs> <laughs> That's it for this episode, guys. We're officially as far away from home as we're going to get on this trip. And now we're going to head down to explore the Daintree and Cairns. So don't forget to like and subscribe.